Morning, I'm Adrian Kennard, and um, I've just got my nice new packs of playing cards that I've just arrived, and uh, they're, they're my first attempt at making some promotional playing cards. Logo on the back, nice and simple, Andrews and Arnold and Firebrick Branding. So let's have a look at the Firebrick ones first, nice little tear-off strip, makes it uh, relatively easy to open. And uh, we have a nice red Firebrick logo on the back, which I'm very pleased with. And yes, it says 52 card pack plus jokers, very straightforward. Um, a double backed card. Um, I put that in anyway, just as a filler. Um, I've noticed that a lot of decks of cards actually have a double backed card. Uh, I assume it's because um, they just want to print a multiple of four cards. But uh, that seems to be the case. So I went for it anyway. I don't know if there's any sort of type of card game that involves a double back card. We then have the, the actual pack and very straightforward. What we have here then are the court cards which are based on, let's have a look at these. These are based on the court cards from an antique deck of cards, about 150 years old this deck. And I meticulously drew these, so we've got now you'll notice that they are a little bit different from your normal court cards because with normal court cards that you find in your, your average deck, the pip is always in the top left. Now I believe this was originally done before they put the index in the corners like this. Uh, I believe it was originally done so that you could uh, see which suit it was more easily when you have a fan in your hand. But obviously now the index is in the corner, that's academic. So these old cards, six of them actually have the pip on the right. And when they were moved to the left, the actual image was completely flipped round. So the design, very similar, even with the modern design, very similar to the old design, though slight, slight variations, um, is a mirror image on six of the cards. So I've gone with the old design. Now these are bridge size cards which are a bit taller and thinner. Well, they're smaller than poker cards, but they're thinner. And so these are a bit distorted. So I think the next batch I do, I think I'm going to bring those down a bit and make them a little less distorted. So that's that's the actual court cards, all based on these, this antique deck. Funnily enough, this deck doesn't have anything from two to six in it. Um, it's a PK deck, so it's a 32 card deck. However, what we have here is an Andrews and Arnold deck, which is slightly different. I thought I'd go for different. The Andrews and Arnold deck, poker card size. Um, perhaps a more common size you would get of a pack of cards. Andrews and Arnold logo on the back. Uh, it's not symmetric, which is, um, well, the fabric one's nice and symmetric, but I don't think it matters really. There are, of course, tricks you can do where you know, pick a card, put it back, you now know which one it is based on the back, but uh, that's not really a problem. Now, this says 56 card deck plus jokers, which is where it gets interesting because we have an 11. Andrew's non deck goes up to 11. And as you can see, the, the court cards are much less distorted on a poker card size because that's the Basically, the size of the antique deck was sort of poker card size. Um, again, I think in future I will actually uh, lock them to the original aspect ratio on this uh, so that they're actually not distorted at all. Uh, the other thing I didn't uh, mention we have on both decks the Jokers. So, as well as a double back card, the Jokers are Ignis, uh, our Firebrick Dragon, even on the Andrews Null deck. And those are my first promotional decks of cards that I've ever had made. Now, having spent a long time actually drawing these cards, I mean, people have been copying playing cards for hundreds of years, um, variations of them, as you've seen. 
I've actually published these as SVGs on my website, so it's www.me.uk slash cards. And there's actually options in there to select the deck you want. There's about 20,000 different versions of decks. So you can have them poker size, bridge size, you can have the pips in both corners, um, which is what I've done on the Andrews Nile deck, or just one corner, or a left-handed deck, or no pips at all, or an old style like the uh, antique deck. There's lots of options, and so you can actually get SVG cards for free from my website.